Prime Minister Honorable Philip J. Pierre, the Cabinet of Ministers, senior government officials, and invited guests held an exchange with a delegation from the African Export Import Bank on February 20th. Professor Benedict Orama heads up the Afrexim Bank as its president and chief executive officer. What I want to assure you is that we understand the responsibility we have. For so many years, we've all, uh, we recognize the need to come together. We recognize the need to, uh, to see how we exploit our markets together. The high-level meeting marked the first step towards exploring opportunities to secure trade and project financing from the Afrexim Bank for the PA administration's development agenda. Would your bank make it easier when a loan is, is, is applied for so that the money can get into the project? What, what, what's the time span that, that you think can happen? Well, that, 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 that's our basic problem. That it takes two, three years, and by the time costs have changed, et cetera, et cetera, and you, you can't, it doesn't have the, the maximum use that it ought to have. No, you are right. It's a problem, but, um, <clears throat> but don't forget that we are an exim bank. We are a trade finance bank. We, we do not have the luxury of delay. So that is the DNA of our, of our bank. If somebody wants to, for example, let's take the simple one. You want to do an export. Uh, you don't have, you, you don't have uh, even uh, six months <laughs> to get the body to do it. Otherwise, it's finished. So we have the DNA of speed. That if you ask anybody, that's what that's one thing they will tell you about a present bank. A potential partnership with the African Export Import Bank could also open doors for Saint Lucia's exporters and manufacturers to the African marketplace. From the office of the Prime Minister, Rihanna Ezelo.